Hey, what's up guys? It's Thani here with Salty Fins. Today, I'm gonna show you guys how to tie up your own sabiki rig and catch you some pinfish. First things first, you're gonna need 15 pound fluorocarbon leader. You can go 15 or 10 pound, as light as possible. The lighter, the better. You're gonna need Mustad beak hook. This is the size 10, I believe, and um, an ounce sinker, pyramid sinker. It doesn't have to be pyramid sinker. It can be like a regular sabiki sinker. I'm gonna show you guys how to tie on these little hooks. I'll just grab two of them. I like, to make, I like to make my own sabiki because it's so much easier um, to de-hook the fish and like there's less hooks, you know? I, I, like to, I like to run with two hooks. That's like, that should be plenty for pinfish or your, your, uh, your grunts. So what I like to do is I'd uh, slide this, see if, you can, see if you guys can see it. I'll slide that through the loop, just like that, right? Go it about a foot up. Just like that, right? And then you want to do like an overhand knot, like that. Okay. Overhand knot, and then go, go again, one more time. So it's a double overhand knot, and then you just cinch it down like that. There you are. There it is. There, there's one there, and then you do another one. Same thing with this one. Slide it through. Overhand knot. That one I just did. I just did one. But um, as long as you cinch it down really good like that, you should be all right. Just like that. And then you just tie the uh, you just tie the pyramid sinker at the end of it like that, guys. That's 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 what you want right there. Some close to that. I'm gonna show you guys the secret bait. This is, this is uh, one of the best baits to use for for targeting pinfish. I find this worked the best right here. Dead stinky shrimp. You know how much I got this for? Four dollars, guys. I had to do it to him. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it up and then um, I'm actually gonna cut it up into like little tiny pieces and put it on the sabiki. Just like that, guys. That should be good right there. That should get us some pinfish. Here we go, first cast. Let it sink all the way to the bottom and just like kind of like jig it like that. I mean, you don't really have to jig it. Just let it sit at the bottom and wait for the bite. Oh, that's a grunt. Look at that. That's what you want right there. That's a, that's a nice size bait. Good size bait, look at that. Perfect snook bait right there. First one, baby, we need like 12 more. <laughs> Load it up with little pieces of shrimp. There it is, that's a, that's a nice one. Oh, 
Oh yeah, nice fish. Perfect bait. Look at that, the targeted species, guys. That's what we want right there. All right, let's let's uh, let's try to catch the targeted species. Here it is. Pinner. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, that's a good size pinfish, guys. Look at that, snook candy. Ouch. That's a snook candy right there. Fatty. <laughs> good size bait. Oh my goodness. It's a fat pinfish. He's been eating good all day, Sunday, so you know. There it is. It's a good size pinfish right there, guys. Oh my goodness. That's what you call bait right there. Perfect um, grouper, snook, trout, redfish, everything eats pinfish. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button for future content. I hope you guys learned a thing or two from this video. If you guys have any tips or suggestions, please leave a comment in the comment section down below. Until next time, I'll see you guys. Peace.